Also making their home debuts on Saturday was North Alabama. They're looking to get to 500 on this young season after last week's loss to Mercer in Montgomery. It was also Brent Deerman's first home game as the head coach. The Lions were without their captain wide receiver Takari Kinnebrew in last week's game in Montgomery, but boy were they happy to have him available for this one. First quarter, first and ten from inside the red zone. Walters drops back, lifts one downfield, and Kinnebrew makes the catch right down the middle in the end zone for the touchdown. What a way to start it off for UNA. Lions would lead 7-0 after the extra point. A little later in the period, Walters drops back, puts one deep again. He's hit as he's thrown, and TK comes down with it. It's a breakaway. TK goes all the way, 59 yards for the touchdown. The Lions take a 14-0 lead. Good things come in threes, and for UNA, it was TK TDs. Kinnebrew would score another in the first half, finishing the opening frame with three catches, all of which for touchdowns on four targets for 105 yards. And with those three scores, he ties the great Harlan Hill for career touchdown receptions at UNA with 19. He entered halftime ranked fourth in all-time touchdown catches. Those three touchdowns by Takari Kinnebrew were not enough to stop a mock comeback as they would score three consecutive touchdowns on three consecutive drives in the third quarter to make this thing a game. But UNA, they pulled out at the end in the fourth quarter to get their first win at home, their first win of the season, and their first win in the Brent Deerman era.